Hi guys, it's Hanny from Eclipse All Sports. So I'm just wanting to bring you a quick video review. So today we're going to look at the SG Sunny Gold Cricket Bats. This is the new colourway. Um, you might have seen Sam Curran is going to be using this colour scheme and he's a new signing with SG. So you'll be seeing more of this colour scheme available. And um, yeah, we just wanted to bring you a quick review of the bats that we've got in stock. Um, so we're going to start off with bat number one. So we've got three of these bats available. So if you are wanting to pick one of these up, then you've got to be quick, guys, because they will sell fast. So grade willow wise, this is a top end grade two. I would say it looks as good as a grade one. I'm pretty sure Sunny Gold used to be classed as a grade one, but with new models being entered and pricing changing. I think Sunny Gold now is classed as a grade 2 but I would say it's a top end grade 2 and like I say a lot of companies would class it as a grade 1. You've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 grains. Yes they're not perfectly straight or perfectly even but it's a clean looking bat and you're getting 11 grains. It's a pretty big profile as well, very long hitting area, laser engraved, Sunny Gold, ribbed style grip, uh, medium round handle, um, you've got the motto in the top of the grip there as well and you've also got the cork inserts, nice ball like I said, down towards the toe, a little bit of wood taken out you can see there, say minimal concave but yeah and then you've got the SG embossed toe guard and you've also got um, the QR code there and the scratch panel uh, so this is an authentication sticker, tells you the model name, you can scan it and confirm this is a genuine SG bat, just to show you the stickers on the back. Um, so this one is cricket bat number one, so if you are interested in this bat, a lot of people keep saying, oh it's not on the website. The website, the old one, we won't be listing any new bats on there. Uh, the products that are on the website at the minute are available, you can purchase those, but none of the new products will be going up on the website. We do have a Facebook shop, all the products will be listed up on the Facebook shop, so keep checking the Facebook shop if you want to find out what we've got in stock at the minute, because uh, that will be up to date with all the products that we've got in. And um, I think in about 7 to 10 days we should have all the bats on the Facebook shop, and then we'll be getting the softs, helmets and everything else on there as well. And we are in the process of getting a new website built, so it will be done guys, it is taking a lot longer than expected. And I do apologise for that, but we will get there and we will get it done eventually. Um, so yeah, this is bat number one, $249.99. Comes with a nice SG back cover as well. I'll just show you the back cover now. So this will be the SG back cover that you'll be getting with the bat. So something similar to this. Um, lovely good quality SG back cover, comes absolutely free. You also get free UK mainland delivery as well. And if you reside outside of the UK and you're wanting to purchase this particular bat, then you will be able to take VAT off that price. So £250, you take 20% off, you're looking at £200 or £199.99 for this bat. So fantastic quality, fantastic value for money. So that's bat one. We will now move on to bat number two. So this one is coming in at £2.9. ounce. So it's a little bit lighter. Hopefully you can see that shape there. And there's the bow on this one. And there's the grains. Again, pretty nice looking. Uh, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight grains on this one. Again, they're not perfectly straight or even, but yeah, it's pretty clean. It's a nice looking bat, nice shape. Again, if you have a look there, there is a little bit of wood taken out, so they are concave in this bat slightly. Um, but if you watch Pujara and if you saw his bat, his bat does have some concaving in it as well. So it's something that they're doing on the player's bats. So don't get too worried. The performance on the bats is still very good. And I will show you the performance in this video. Um, so you've got a round handle all the way up. And the motto again in the handle. And there's the cork inserts. Um, so that is bat number two. So finally bat number three. So this one is a little bit heavier than bat number two. This one's 29.5. Again, nice looking bats. This one's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine grains on this one. So yeah, lovely looking. Nice profile. This one 
A little bit of wood again taken out, which is good because it helps with the balance and the pickup. Thatch fit toe guard, nice bow. Really good pickups on these, I would say. Um, so that is bat number three. So we've got bat two, bat one. So we'll talk about the balance and the pickup, and we'll give them all a tap with the ball now. Uh, so bat one is two pound ten ounce, and for me. The handle's probably a touch, I would say medium, medium to thin. I would prefer the handle to be a little bit thicker, so maybe a second grip or a thicker grip. But the pickup is nice. I would say it feels about two nine, two nine and a half max. But I think if you put a thicker grip or a second grip, it's going to pick up lovely. Uh, but yeah, the balance on this is very good. So we'll just give it a tap with the test LE ball and see how it goes. So performance wise, feels pretty good straight out of the pack. It goes slightly high pitch sound. Goes well in the middle. Up high. It's pretty good up high. Down towards the toe. It's pretty decent down towards the toe. So yeah, it's a good bat. I think once it's been oiled and knocked in, it will improve. There is some shallow seam indentations. Um, so I think it will get better with oil and knocking in. Um, probably not as good as some of the bats straight out of the packet, but I think this is one that will improve through oiling and knocking in. So that's bat number one. And then bat number two, so this one is uh, £2.9. Ounce. And yeah, it picks up really nice. It feels probably like a 2.8.5, 2.8. Feels really nicely balanced. Um, so yeah, that little bit of concaving certainly helps the balance and the pickup. And yeah, they feel really good in the hands. Uh, Performance wise, this one's got a similar feel to bat one. It's got that firmer feel to it. Higher pitch sound. The rebound is still very good. And I don't think they'll take too much playing in, but I think they will improve once they've been oiled and knocked in. There's some shallow seam indentations, nothing too deep. But yeah, they certainly will improve through knocking in and um, yeah, a few net sessions and I think they'll really open up. Um, so we'll move on now to the final bat, which is bat number three. Um, so this one's two nine and a half. And again, it picks up really nice. So it just shows you what a bit of concaving can do to help and improve the balance and the pickup of the bat. Um, because all three of these bats pick up really nice. And I can guarantee if they were full in shape, or a lot less concaving than what they've got, I don't think they would pick up quite as good. Um, so yeah, really nice pickup. Performance wise, this one's got the nicest sound out of the three bats. Really nice and springy. Not as firm as the other two. Very responsive. So yeah, really nice ping, really good bat. So I would recommend out of the three, straight out of the packet, number three has probably got the best performance. Um, number two has definitely got the lightest pickup. And then if you want in a bat that's 210 that picks up like a 29, then probably go for bat number one. But just bear in mind, bat number one and two got a slightly firmer feel, but once they've been oiled and knocked in, I think they will soften and open up uh, quite quickly. So, but yeah, if you want an instant performance and something that's gonna feel good straight away, then bat number three is probably the choice out of the three bats. This one goes really well straight out of the packet. So I hope you've enjoyed this video review. If you have, please give us a thumbs up and a like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, then please do so. We are going to give a, a free players cricket bat away once we reach 30,000 subscribers. So it's well worth subscribing, not just for the videos that we bring you, but also for the giveaways that we do. And if you would like to give us a follow on Instagram, we will be giving a free cricket bat away if we reach 5,000 followers by the end of September. So yeah, thanks again guys. Until next time, I'll speak to you all soon. Bye bye.